Hello everyone, this is King LT. This video I will show you how to use ESP32 module make a Wi-Fi repeat. Now we can use this KC868A4 board. Also you can use A8 board because we just use this ESP32 module. Uh, sometimes your house is very big and the Wi-Fi signal is not very well and the, you have only one route. And this time I will show you how to use this ESP32 module make a Wi-Fi repeat so that uh, in every room uh, you have put this board and it can generate the Wi-Fi signal for your mobile phone or your computer to use. Okay, let's begin how to do with it. Uh, we can see this is our A4 board. Also, we have the A8 board because we have used the ESP32. And this is lesson 21. How to make a Wi-Fi repeat use ESP32. Actually, you can also use the ESP 8266 uh, chip is auto support. We just need to prepare for this download tool and the load freeware, uh, this two file. Uh, just click this website to download the download tool of the ESP Wi-Fi module. You can click uh, this fresh download tool, uh, download for the Windows version. And if you have used Apple Mac, uh, you can download the corresponding version from the website and I have downloaded this file and uh, this file uh, downloaded from our website this is a firmware so you will find you, uh, you have these two folder and download use uh, this two folder you just firstly to open this file uh, this download tool uh, before download tool open it you can connect the the power of the board and the USB connect to your computer. So we can double click. And you will see uh, this is a logo file. And in this window, you just click ESP32. If you use ESP8266, you can choose this, this one. Now I choose this one. And in the work mode, I choose the development and I press OK. And you will see this window. This window, you need to load the freeware and we can click this file to open. We can go to this load, a zip file. You just unzip and go to the build. And the first is the bootload. Click this bootload bin, open. And the second, you can choose the second ESP32 bin file, open. And the third, you choose this one. An example and you can click the checkbox of these three items and this one you need to input the address this address is three address uh, we can you can see I can I have right on this three address the first one is 0x1000 and the second is 0x10000 and the three is 0x8000. Okay. And this COM part, just you use the USB, have connected, uh, uh, it's the server part. I have used COM7. This according to your computer. You can see the device manager on your Windows. You can find out which COM part you have used. And now we just click the start, will be begin download. And this settings just uh, as the default, not to change anything. I just click start. And now begin to download. And this is the output, the log file. We just find which uh, the progress uh, until finish. Okay, now it's finished. We just can close this window and you can let the board power off and power on. And we can click this Wi-Fi signal. And you can see uh, this is my Wi-Fi. Uh, because I have used this module, uh, the default is ESP32. Uh, you will find a signal means ESP32. We can connect with this Wi-Fi signal. OK, when you connect it, you just Open this IP address, the default is 4.1. This is 4.1. Uh, because I have used this 
uh, module before. Uh, this is very important. The default is the ESP32 begin with the SSID is your signal. Now the relay is on off because the freeware default have used this IO GPIO pins. We just not need to see it. And uh, in this form, uh, this website, you just set this STA setting. This is for your first load, just your house load, the main load. Uh, this is my office, King Kony, and this is the password. You need to set by yourself. And you can press connect. Then the ESP32 module will connect to this main load. And this AP setting, that means this Wi-Fi SSID for your mobile phone or for your PC to use. So you can change this. Uh, this I have set this in my Wi-Fi. Uh, you can also uh, change ESP32 Wi-Fi. And the password is 1234567 and press set and uh, wait reboot and you can see uh, this displayed this is ESP32 Wi-Fi I can click this uh, the new signal and uh, connect and now it's connected so I can input the kingconnect.com Uh, you can see uh, the website is opened and this is use internet by the ESP32 module also now you can you can see I can use my mobile phone and also use the set and the Wi-Fi uh, you can choose the ESP32 Wi-Fi and now it's connected with ESP32 Wi-Fi and also I can use the web browser and open and you can see uh, this website this website is opened by the internet from the ESP module okay this is how to use the ESP32 used by the Wi-Fi repeat thanks for watching